சர்ஃபேஸ் டென்ஷன் In the diagram, we have a layer of liquid. This is a layer of liquid which is at rest. Now we can consider in an imaginary line. This is the liquid uh, layer, and we can consider an imaginary line or tangent. AB is the imaginary tangent on the free surface of liquid at rest, and uh, a force F acts. Uh, at right angles and on both sides of this line if is the force which acts at the right angle to this imaginary line and on both sides of uh, this imaginary tangent and this force is also acting on the free surface tangentially we can consider another edge of this liquid layer xy is the edge of this liquid layer and uh, this force is also acting at right angles to this uh, imaginary line xy on this free surface of liquid at rest xy is the imaginary line uh, and l is the length of the imaginary line or tangent ab or xy surface tension surface tension is the property of a liquid by virtue of which the free surface of liquid at rest the free surface of liquid at rest behaves the free surface of liquid at rest behaves as an elastic stretched membrane behaves as an elastic stretched membrane with the tendency to contract so as to occupy with the tendency to to contract so as to occupy a minimum surface area this is the free surface of liquid which has a tendency to occupy minimum surface area due to surface tension also surface tension of a liquid at rest can be measured surface tension of a liquid can be measured as the force can be measured as the force acting on unit length of an imaginary line ab imaginary line ab drawn tangentially on the free surface of liquid at rest it acts this force of surface tension acts at right angles to this line ab on both sides and along the tangent and uh, tangentially to the free surface of liquid free surface of liquid let if be the force which acts if be the force which acts at right angles which acts at right angles to the imaginary tangent which acts at right angles to the imaginary tangent ab of length l on the free surface of liquid layer on the free surface of liquid at rest if be the force which acts at right angles to the imaginary tangent ab of length l on the free surface of liquid at right angles and on both sides of the imaginary tangent therefore the surface tension the surface tension that is the force of surface tension surface tension that is the force of surface tension of the liquid is given by the surface tension of the liquid is given by 
S equal force divided by length, force acting on unit length of the imaginary line. That's why S is equal F by L. F by L. So S equal F by L, that is the surface tension acting on a liquid layer or acting on a liquid drop. S has the expression that is S equal F by L, which is the surface tension acting on acting on a liquid surface acting on a liquid surface or liquid drop or a liquid drop surface tension s is equal to f by l which is the surface tension acting on a liquid surface of length l or liquid drop also s is equal to f by 2l also s equal f by 2l which is the surface tension which is the surface tension acting which is the surface tension acting on a liquid film or soap bubble s equal f by 2l which is the surface tension acting on a liquid film or soap bubble where 2l is the effective length where 2l is the effective length of liquid film along which 12 is the effective length of liquid film along which soap solution or liquid soap solution or liquid is in contact with air is in contact with air s equal f by l which is the surface tension acting on liquid film or soap bubble but s is equal f l f by l is the surface tension acting on a liquid surface unit of surface tension s is newton per meter because S is equal to F by L, force divided by length. That's why the unit of surface tension S is equal to Newton per meter. Surface tension is a scalar quantity. Surface tension is, is a scalar quantity. Scalar quantity it as it has no definite direction. And uh, we can write down the dimension of surface tension. Dimension of surface tension. S is m t to the power minus 2. Third bracket S is equal m t to the power minus 2. Third bracket closed. That is the dimension of surface tension. m t to the power minus 2.